There's no mistaking how much power Jaguar's new XJR575 makes. It's right there in the name, the three digits contained therein declaring the 575 hard charging horses stuffed under the hood of the Jaguar XJ, the company's largest sedan. It's also seemingly everywhere you look, embroidered on four of the five seats, emblazoned on the dorsals, stuck on the trunk, and prominently displayed at the top of the dashboard. In Jaguar's not-so-subtle branding of this car, it's as if horsepower is some kind of abstract, intangible idea, something that cannot be seen nor heard nor felt. But in the XJR575, those workhorses can very much be seen and heard and felt, and the best advertisement of all this power can be found under the driver's right foot. Squeeze the accelerator to the floor and Jaguar's big sedan does a convincing impression of the company's classic leaper hood ornament, lunging forward and streaking across the landscape. The world beyond the glass blurs, the supercharged V8 bellows, and the thrust compresses your guts. The XJR575 is the latest, and possibly the last, testosterone injection for the 80-year-old XJ. Sharing its supercharged 5.0-liter V8 with the F-Type SVR, the XJR575 gets a 25-horse bump over the XJR it replaces while torque rises 14 pounds to foot to 516. Jaguar claims that the XJR575 will run from 0 to 60 miles per hour in 4.2 seconds. But we've seen the 550 horsepower XJR make the run in as little as 3.8 seconds and expect the 575 to knock a tenth off the time. What's even more impressive is how swift this car is on a back road. Even though its exterior dimensions are par for the segment, the XJ's cabin feels far narrower than those of the Audi A8, BMW 7 Series, and Mercedes-Benz S-Class. That sense of compactness helps punctuate the feeling of smallness and lightness the driver experiences behind the wheel. Mostly, though, that sensation comes from the XJ's aluminum-intensive chassis. At about 4,350 pounds, the long wheelbase XJR575, the only version of the XJR575 that's come into the United States weighs roughly 750 pounds less than BMW's 600 horsepower M760i and 700 pounds less than a Mercedes AMG S63, though both of those models are burdened with the extra weight of all-wheel drive. Still, the XJR575 is no luxury barge. Nimble and lithe, the XJR's athleticism stands out in contrast with the bank vault on wheels character that's common in this class of near limos. There's less float and isolation than you'll find in most competitors, with well-connected steering, firm but not uncomfortable damping, and tight roll control. And while rear seat legroom is prodigious, the XJR575 feels like a car designed around the driver rather than the back seat. Starting at $123,395 when it goes on sale by the end of 2017, the XJR575 will cost just $1,400 more than last year's long wheelbase 550 horse XJR. It's distinguished from lesser XJs, which remain available in short and long wheelbases, by two hood vents, a spoiler, unique side sills, and gloss black exterior trim in place of traditional chrome accents. 20-inch gloss black wheels mount over red brake calipers. And for buyers seeking a six-figure boy racer, a decidedly Subaru-ish hue called Velocity Blue, shown here, can be had for $4,080.